What up everybody, Josh Ship here. Hope you're doing very well. I'm coming at you with some exciting details about what is going to likely be my very last speaker seminar. Now, before you get all angry and start weeping and gnashing your teeth and sending me threatening emails, threatening to steal my dog, let me explain to you as to why this is going to be the last speaker seminar that I do. Now, this is not some sort of weird like marketing strategy like, oh, it's going to be my last seminar. You should sign up and then actually do, you know, 90 more of them. That is not what this is. Here's what it is. I have a lot of exciting things going on in my business and I am the sort of person that I want to focus on a handful of things and do them exceptionally well. So before we get into the details as to why you should join me July 16th, 17th and 18th in San Diego, California, Let's talk about, um, you know, maybe like what some of those doubts are, those fears are, those concerns are that are going on in your mind, right? I'm no psychic. I'm not Miss Cleo. I'm not there, you know, in your house standing behind you as you watch this video right now. I am. Look behind you. Um, but let's talk about what some of those common fears and concerns are. For some of you, and some of you said this on the survey, so Josh, I just don't know how to get started. Like, I want to speak to people. I feel like I know sort of what I want to say, but I mean, how do I get paid and who do I ask to book me and how do I get started and all that? I want you to know at the seminar, I'm going to walk you through all of that, A to Z, everything, all the details. Yes, we're going to have a good time. Yes, it's going to be fun, but you should know, like, I'm sort of a nerd. Like, I love checklists and, and lists and details. I'm going to walk you through all of the details of how to get it done. It will be foolproof for you. I'm going to actually give you email scripts that I have used, my private clients have used, to book speaking engagements. I'm going to give you scripts of like uh, what to say once you get the correct person on the phone with you, what to say as to how to close a speaking engagement. Because here's the thing, I mean, a lot of people when they first start, they spend way too much time doing a bunch of crap that isn't going to get them booked and not enough time um, doing the things that they should. So I'm going to help you differentiate what those are. Uh, another thing, and I don't want to get all like motivational speaker on you, but I want you to know that you can do this. You can do this. If you have a dream, a goal of speaking to people and making a living at that, you can do that. I don't care whether your audience is students like mine is or college students or you know, female entrepreneurs or professional gardeners or whatever your you know, sort of desired audience is, you can do this. I mean, when I first started, I was 17 years old and I was living in Oklahoma and no one else there was a professional speaker. I felt like I had no one to turn to. I had no sort of vision or game plan, right? I mean, I, people would ask me, what do you want to do when you grow up? And I'd say, I want to be a professional speaker. And they'd say, well, that's good. You should have a backup plan. Like, how depressing is that? So I want you to know that you can do this. And it, here's kind of the weird thing, right? You know me as Josh Ship now, right? You got to understand. Like 11 years ago when I started, I was just like you. I had a dream, I had this idea, but you know what changed that is that I took action. I said, you know what, man, I'm tired of thinking about this. I'm actually going to do it. That's why you know of me today. That's why these cool things are happening. Not because I sat around and thought about them, but because I took action on them and decided I was going to commit myself to doing this. And you need to do that exact same thing. So here's another um, concern that a lot of people have. And I had this when I first started is you have to invest in your business. And for a lot of people, this gets really iffy psychologically, right? Because if I say to you, invest in your business, well, it's easy to like, oh, I need to buy a building and then I'm gonna you know, fix it up and sell it. Oh yeah, that's investing in my business. But when I say invest in your business, as a speaker, what I'm really saying is invest in yourself. And that gets really weird psychologically for people, right? Because we have this sort of guilt complex where like if I go out and see a movie that inspires me, that's not an investment, I've wasted money. Or if I buy a book or go to a seminar or get this coaching or this and that. Um, you, you need to shift that thinking in your mind. You have to invest in yourself as a speaker. Here are the details. Um, mark down on your calendar to join me in San Diego, California, July 16th, 17th, and 18th. If you know anything about my past seminars, they've only been two days. But you're going to get 
<laughs> you're gonna get, that would look really weird. It's like a reverse, like flipping it off or something. You're gonna get three days, because on the third day, I'm going to add something really cool that I've never done before that I think will not only be a lot of fun for you and interesting for you, but really valuable for your business as a speaker or an author or a seminar leader. So um, let's go through some more questions. Who should attend, right? You should attend if you are beginning or intermediate, right? So if, you've, if you want to do this, but you've never booked a speech, or you've only booked a couple speeches, or if you're intermediate, right, where things are going pretty well, you're booking some speaking engagements, but you want to book more gigs, you want to speak to more people, you want to make more money, make more impact, this is going to be designed A to Z for those that are beginning or intermediate. Uh, another question you may have, Josh, how much does it cost? Well, let's talk about this. First of all, not to brag, but I really don't need your money. I don't. I'm doing very well financially because of the things going on, because of the things in my business. And I grew up very poor, so I don't like bathe in gold. I don't really waste my money. I don't own a plane or a helicopter or um, gold sculpted dragons or something, although that does sound pretty cool. I might get a couple of those. Uh, but I don't really need your money as much as I need your investment. Because what I do by charging people to come to this is I weed out the people that aren't serious. So if you're not serious about this and you're not willing to invest, cool. I don't want you coming anyway. I don't. Because then you're going to come to my seminar, I'm going to tell you exactly what to do, and you're not going to do it because you're not the sort of person that's ready to take this seriously. So I'm only interested in helping, in helping around a dozen people that are serious about this. Because then it's going to be great for you. You're going to be out there and be, in, be successful. And it'll be cool for me to be able to sit back one day and say, hey, I help her get started. I help him get started. So, and also, oh, here's one other thing I kind of thought of. Isn't it weird that if you don't feel like it's worthwhile paying for advice, that then you're going to try to go out and ask people to pay for yours? That may be a bit of a slap in the face, but you probably need to hear it. If you don't see advice and knowledge as valuable, then you're going to have a hard time making it in this business. So it's going to be, you're going to have two options with a seminar. Option number one, 1900 bucks, or you can make four payments on that if that's easier for you. And option number two is going to be around $2,900, or you can make four payments. Now, um, the two options will depend on sort of some of the extras you can add on and ongoing coaching that you can add on. I'll tell you all the details next week. So why did I price it at basically two to three thousand bucks? It's because when you're beginning or intermediate, that's how much you can make on one speech pretty easily with the stuff that I'm going to teach you. Now for me, I'm very conservative with my money, so I thought if I'm in this situation, what do I want to see? Well, I want to see an immediate return on my investment. So think about it like this. You come to the seminar, and out of the bazillion things I teach you, you take one home and you apply it, and you get at least over the next year one booking. Just one. For two to three grand, boom, you've made your money back from one booking, right? And I'm sorry, but you would be an idiot not to get at least a dozen bookings from all the valuable stuff that I'm going to teach you. Now, here's the thing my private clients pay me around $30,000 per year to work with them coach them. You're going to get all the same glory and goodness and knowledge that I give to them for a fraction of the price. So um, let's be blunt with each other. You've seen my other seminars. I limit it to about a dozen people and you've seen them sell out in a couple days. This one's going to be no different. As a matter of fact, this one's probably going to be a bit more psychotic in the sense that previously I've had about 25 people on the interest list and sold out a dozen seats in a couple days. Right now, because of the Inc. Magazine article and such, I have about 500 people on the interest list. And again, I have about a dozen seats open. So if you want to skip the madness, the hoopla, the after Thanksgiving shopping where you get punched in the face by someone trying to grab the last Teletubby or whatever random thing it is, below this video somewhere, there is an obnoxious red arrow that I drew. And there's a place where you can put in your email address for the early bird list. So what this is, is I will email my early bird list a couple hours before I release it to everyone else and to the general public. So if you'd like to cut in line, if you're ready to take this seriously, if you're ready to um, invest and commit 
and get your career started or take it to the next level, just put your email address in the early bird box below and I'll let you cut in line and email you a couple hours or maybe even a day before if I'm feeling uh, pretty generous or whatever. So thanks for watching this video. Thanks for your interest. Please, I encourage you, if you have a good message, if you're a good person and you really want to do this to get started, early bird list below. Talk to you next week.